So the Lord said, I have indeed seen the misery of my people. Sabi nga po nila, yung buhay, parang buhay ng Christian is like the life of the Israelites. Kaya kung tayo po minsan, uh, maraming challenges, maraming pinagdadaanan, ang sabi ng Panginoon, nakikita ko ang mga nangyayari sa'yo, nakikita ko ang mga kabigatan mo. I have indeed seen the misery of my people. I have heard them crying out. I see, I heard, and I am concerned. God is concerned with us. Amen po ba? Pinapakinggan, tinitignan po tayo ng Panginoon. So sabi niya, So I have come down to rescue them from the hand of the, the Egyptians and to bring them up out of the land and to a good and a spacious land flowing with milk and honey. So may plano po ang Panginoon from Egypt, alam po, Dadalhin niyo po dadalhin niyo niya po sa sa land of where uh, there's a flowing of honey and milk. Ibig sabihin po, sobrang prosperous tong land na to. Again, that's the plan of God in our lives also as Christians. Hindi po plano ng Panginoon na doon lang tapos sa e- sa Egypt. Ang plano pa talaga ng Panginoon is to bring us to our destiny. Yun yung po yung totoo nating destiny the land of Canaan. Pero may problema po rito, sabi, the home of the Canaanite, Canaanites, Hittites, Amorites, Perisites, Hebesites, and Jubisites. These are the enemies of the Israel. These are the enemies of God. Minsan po may nagbiro, kulang po yung mga tights, yung mga heavy tights, yung mga Canaanites yan. Sinasali po rito yung ano, yung mga hindi nagtatights. Pati na rin daw po yung kaaway ng Panginoon, kaaway ng mga Israelites. Kaya pag hindi, hindi po tayo nagtatites, kabilang po tayo sa listahan ng mga tights, tights, tights na yan. So, he called Moses out. Sabi niya rito, So now, go, I am sending you to Pharaoh to bring my people, the Israelites, out of Egypt. So that's the mission. Yun pa yung naging mission ni Moses para ilabas ang kanyang mga tao sa Egypto pero hindi po ganoon kadali. Sabi dito, the Lord said to Moses, "When you return to Egypt, see that you perform before Pharaoh all the wonders had given you the power to do." So binigyan po ng Diyos si Moses ng kapangyarihan through the staff pero mayroon po rito, may contrasting. Sabi niya, but, gusto gusto po yung word na but, I will harden his heart so that he will not let the people go. Hindi po ba contrasting? Sabi niya, uh, Moses, bring out my people from the land of Egypt to, to Canaan. Pero sabi niya, but, I will harden his heart ang sinasabi ito si Pharaoh. So may, medyo pag, may pagka-contrasting, di ba? Kasi kung ako si si Moses, Lord, ano ba talaga? Ilalabas ko sila, but you will harden the heart of, the, of Pharaoh and the Egyptians. Paano yon? 